Hey, welcome back to my Rogue Tech campaign. So the last episode, we just outfitted our Light Lance, which is going to turn into our Pirate Lance. And we, between episodes, we moved from, um, where was it here? Uh, Fenardir to Aspropagos. So this used to be a former colony, colony of the Magistrate of Cannabis. Now, I don't know if the Free Worlds League has got full control over this, but I do know there's a lot of pirates that are operating from here. The Magistrate of Cannabis has kind of informed us that there's some uh, pirate groups that have been raiding along here. Hope, I, I think they've probably been trying to destabilize the Magistrate of Cannabis to stop them from taking their worlds back. So what we're going to do today is we're going to go in here and we're going to try and wipe out as many of these pirates as possible. Now, the plan is this. We kind of have an idea of where their leader is. The Magistrate of Cannabis was able to kind of pinpoint roughly where he's located. So we're going to have a three-pronged attack. So the very first thing we're going to do is we're going to send our Light Lance in as a distraction. And what we're going to do is we're going to attack their main base. And their main base uh, isn't too heavily guarded. Um, but what that'll do is it'll draw their attention from other places on the planet to try and come back to find out what's going on or to um, help reinforce the base. And our medium lance is going to lay an ambush for group one. Um, we know there's a rough, there's like a heavy group of mechs that's uh, patrolling around near um, government and magistry of cannabis uh, areas. So it's probably going to end up pulling those closer to their base. So we're going to ambush those guys. And then our main unit, our heavy unit, is going to go in and try and take out their leader. Now they do have a fair number of heavy mechs, so we're going to have to be very, very wary of that. So this first episode will be the... Um, episode where the pirate lance goes in and causes a distraction. So let's get right to that. I'll see you guys down on the planet. All right, welcome to the ground. So here's the base here we're going to attack. Now we've heard that they've probably got a, a uh, lance here defending it. So we're going to move in. Now I put Odin in charge here. She was the first uh, mech warrior I hired uh, for this lance. So she's going to be in charge. Um, and she's running the butcher with our rotary auto cannon and our LRM 10. And then we've got Puffin, who was the second guy I hired. I'm putting him in, because he's got such um, uh, good skills, we put him in the Firestarter, because the Firestarter is really the mech that I want to keep alive the most. Uh, it's, to me, it's other than the Butcher, it's the most valuable mech on the field. And then we've got Sly Rule and the, pan the uh, Panther here. Really just a fire support vehicle. Not really happy with the way that guy got laid out. And then Photon, because as her name implies, Photon is relatively fast, so we're going to put her in the uh, spider. All right. So let's get Photon in first. And we're going to see if we can actually see if they've got turrets here. Okay, what do we got? Looks like we just got turrets at the moment. Or are these vehicles? That I think is a turret. That's a turret. That's a turret. I don't know what this is. It's a defender of some kind. Alright, let's get puffing up there. So I'm thinking both puffin and um, Photon. I'm going to try and move straight down the uh, evasion line. And then of course slide rule and... Uh, and Odin are going to be on the uh, gunnery line. Good to go. Roger that. Full speed. So I think maybe we should probably move the triple strength Myanmar's out of the spider. Maybe put them in the butcher there. Okay, so we got a mech coming in here. And another mech. And another mech. I've been sensor locked. And they're sensor locking already. I see that. Okay, we need to bank left here. We're going to move left this turn. Get out of the distance of these guys. There's just too much firepower there. So we're going to try and take this mech on. So Photon's going to move out of here first. Actually, she's got more evasion, doesn't she? No, she doesn't. She's got two. So let's get her around here. Actually, is that in the woods there? It is. Okay, that's where we want to be. So we're going to move around this side. Let's take this guy on. What do we got here? A goblin. Ah, uh, figures. Figures. Let's just open up on this guy. 
Okay, he's tagged. That's good. Okay. Looks like they're having the same problems that we are. And let's have a look at Puffin now. Let's get him around here. So let's put some flames on this guy. How good of a chance do we have to hit? Ah, not that great. I'm gonna fire him. We're gonna leave the vehicle flamer off for now until we have a better chance to hit. A couple of them, that's okay. 44 heat. Wow. Oh yeah, I forgot how much heat damage this thing does. It's crazy. I love that. I love that mech though. That's just awesome, that fire starter. Okay, let's get the panther up here. Let's see what kind of damage we're gonna deal with this build. Firing everything on the goblin. Look at those SRMs. We're just gonna leave them off for now. We got 80. We got 80 rounds, so it's just a little over uh, what, 13 turns in firing. So we're just gonna leave them okay. off. That didn't hit. Nope. Supporters. You got the plus three TTS too, man. What's going on? Um. Nothing we can get the rack on, eh? Doesn't look like it. Let's reserve. See if anybody moves closer. Oh, they're gonna sensor lock, damn it. Just gonna reserve again. So what turret is that? That's the back corner. No, it's this side, okay. Back left. We have to kill that turret. Oh, you can see us from there, can you? Okay, so Odin, still can't see anybody. That's fine, we'll just move up. The LRMs are a waste of time, I think. It's probably going to be less than 10%. Yeah, nine. there's no point. So we're just going to reserve. Alright, let's see what they do here. Where's that goblin going? Okay, so I think I want to take... We take the high ground, or what do we do here? We got the missile launcher back here, and this is probably a laser turret. If we kill these two guys, then we're still getting shot from everywhere. Like my thought was to come around this way. I really want to make sure that we don't get uh, killed here. I mean, I could... Even if we go down here, we're still taking on four guys at once. Let's reserve, see what they do. Of course. Now we have to move. Um, Receiving you. Let's get you in the woods. We're going to get eyes on the turret, so we'll know what's in there. Let's do this. Confirmed. What are we looking at here? A light turret. It's only got a hundred. Cattle master. Okay, we can smash that guy. I don't know what this guy is yet. But we do want to fire on the goblin. Yeah, we're going to overheat already. This is crazy. Um, let's leave one of these guys off. Put the vehicle flamer on. No. Just go this route. Definitely want to get exchangers. Okay, let's keep that guy above middle heat there. Comes the cattle master. I did have a few cattle master parts saved up, but I thought it might be funny to build a cattle master with an internal combustion engine. And I, and I thought, no, that, that's not <laughs> that's not funny at all. Uh, so I just sold the parts. All right, let's get in on this turret. Let's get into here. Bring the butcher into bear. All righty, AC5 rotary on this turret. Not bad chances to hit. That's pretty good. There we go. Come on, come on, come on. There we go. Nice. So one turret down. Turret Not sure what turret was sensor locking, but uh, that's power armor. Which I guess in a way is kind of a saving grace. It's I know it's hard to hit, but doesn't pack as much punch as, punch as a regular mech would punch. So let's bring around here. Quick and what do we got? 40... Wow, even less. 
So I'm gonna put the SRMs on. Let's fire at this guy. Ah, small laser and one missile. 15 points though. It's kind of nice. That dead fire ammo is pretty cool. Got a lock on me. That's okay, girl. Just hang on. What's up, boss? Let's do your job. Let's get in here. No, let's reserve. We're gonna wait for those turrets to fire. I'm coming around behind that guy. Damage is light. So Ready. first I want to see what chances are to hitting this guy. Not very good. And if we sprint to like here, 77. Let's give that cattle master a rude surprise. Double time. Let's go. That's what this spider was built for, this venom was built for, is the tax from behind. So let's fire everything in this guy's rear. Maybe I'll move the TTS plus three in this guy. Yes! Goodbye! Target eliminated. That's what you were built for, girl. That's exactly what that mech was built for. Okay, here comes somebody for melee. Really? Good thing I got nothing in the right arm. Ow. Oh, he's going down. Really? That is not good. Oh. I'm wounded, Commander. <sighs> okay, two choices. I could engage this turret. Standing by. Let's do this. This guy is too much of a problem for me and he needs to be stopped, so let's do this. 47 damage with one flamer, plus 30 heat, so that must have been the uh, vehicle flamer that hit. Yeah. Only 9 damage though, so it's not too bad. Okay, Photon, I need you back here before they shoot you. And what's the chance to hit this guy? 20s. If I come back here, 34s. Well, still better. See if we can get the tag on this guy. Okay, we got the tag on him. Good. Odin, let's get back here. Actually, you know what? Let's get you a little further back. Where can we go? Right here. Just because of the LRM. Yeah, still really lousy chances to hit on this guy. Even worse on this guy, but we're gonna fire anyway. Got one hit anyway. Couple missiles, not too bad, not too bad. They've got a lock on me. Yep. Where are the missiles coming? They're coming down here though. Left arm called shot. Okay, so we're gonna stand up. And we're going to do something that we absolutely have to do. Besides, you know, backing up. Uh, we're going to back up. We can't let them take our right, our left side. So we're going to move back here. And we're probably not going to hit no matter what we do anyway. So let's leave the big gun off. Do an offensive push on this goblin because he needs to die. And in order to do that, we got to shut him down. Let's leave these off. Just fire the small. Okay, so he'll be back one turn now. Turn three. At least it's only three guys guarding. Okay, so first things first. Puffin, we need to move. So he's sensor locked, so we need to move back. Uh, we're going to turn our torso like this. What's our chance to hit here? Still 56, 63 with the arm weapon, so we're going to move back here. Once again, we're going to shoot this guy straight in the back. Uh, we're going to have to leave one of the flamers off, I guess. But we don't need much to shut him down. I think one hit. 44 heat. That's two hits. He's shut down. 
Sucks to be you, dude. Okay. So, let's get Odin. Since you're sensor locked. No, sorry, photon sensor locked. Let's get you back here. And we're going to shoot this guy in the center torso back. Oh, wait, we got a damaged torso here. Engine. We're going to go for this torso. One hit and he's done. Nope, two hits. That ah, doesn't matter. We got him. Okay, let's work on this power armor now. And we can finish up the turrets. Can I actually hit the power armor with this guy? Why can't I hit the power armor? Is he hidden? Wow, such low chance to hit. Tell you what. Um, let's get some evasion. Let's move forward. And start targeting these buildings. Double time. Let's go. So we've heard the heavy lance is on its way. And our second unit is going to move to intercept them. SRMs are out of range because of the... Um, All right, Odin, let's finish this up, see if we can hit this power armor. Actually, we know what, we're a lot too close, for, really too close for that guy, so we're going to move back here. And let's take this building out. We should be able to finish this building up. Well, maybe not. Let's fire on it anyway. Pretty close. Alright, let's see what we're going to do against this guy here. Hmm, unstable. Maybe we get... What do we got chances-wise? 23%. That's not very good, is it? What about the flamers? So if we move back here... Slightly better, but not much. So let's do... Let's go with Photon first. Yeah, 23. We're just going to turn this way. Shoot this guy straight in the back. Hopefully we hit with at least one. Oh, there's one. Nice. Oh, torso done. Let's see what he does now. Jump around all you want, buddy. Okay, there's a miss. Let's get... Ready for orders. You back Fine. here. Now... What's our chance? we got a pretty good chance to hit now. Okay, let's unload with the three flamers. There we go. Excellent. All right, so let's get in close, finish up these turrets. Missile turrets, the back left. Uh, let's get on this guy right here. Let's get the rotary on him. It's a light turret, so it should go down quickly. Ah, only one, one of those hit. All right, slide rule, let's get you up. Turn sideways on this guy. And fire everything. Yeah, those SRMs are just not doing it for me. Stand still, dummy. Ouch. Uh-oh. Could get a knockdown here. Uh-oh. Going down. Down to one. Yikes! You need to get the hell out of town. Reporting. Serious armor loss. I saw that. Okay. Um, how can we do this here? Standing by. So that turret can see you. So if I move here, I should be blocking the turret's view. We can finish up this guy. Got it. 
Okay. I don't know if this guy can see me with the LRMs though. Just don't have the speed to get up where we want to be here. Let's get to here. Can we actually use the flamers on this building? It's out of range. I can use a vehicle flamer though. Let's just give it a shot. Oh, there we go. Wow, 75 damage. That's crazy. Good shot, Commander. Enemy structure down. Okay, let's get Photon. Let's get to a point where this other turret can probably see us and maybe he'll shoot on us instead. Um, let's get into the trees though. Yeah. Okay, Photon, what do we got here? 34s, 60s, and a 72. Same here. Let's go up to the small building. If we hit with all four, we can take it down. Ugh, oh, almost. Oh, okay. They can't see us, thank goodness. Time for you to get out of here, buddy. Now, I think he is hidden enough so we can fire on this building here. I don't think they can see us now anyway. That was close though, I gotta, I gotta say. Oh, him almost dying like that. Alright, Photon, let's see what you can do, girl. Let's get this turret gone. We can get the LRMs on this too. Yeah, so even if we hit with everything, we can't kill it. We'd be one point short. Yeah, we're one point short. So we gotta hit it with the uh, LRMs. Now I don't have, I do have multi-target. Okay, good. So let's move in here. Get a multi-target. Target this guy and this guy. LRMs to B, let's just fire. Oh, three hits, nice. And we should be able to kill this turret. Yep. Excellent. All right, let's toast some buildings here. Ready for orders. Moving to position. So all the flamers should burn a building down, no problem. And let's grab one of the biggest ones here. Which is this guy got on him? 150. Let's do this guy. Roger. There we go. Yep. Up in smoke. All right, you, let's get you up here. Copy that. I'm kind of glad you survived. That was uh, pretty that. hairy there for a bit. So I'm going to need to figure out what to do with this mech. That one. Maybe we do go back to the large laser. I don't know. Receiving you. Medium. What do we got? Medium over here? It's fire on this guy. All right, let's get slide rule the last the last laugh on this building. I got you. Maybe not. Ready for orders. Odin, fire it up. Excellent. Now Sumeria can get us out of here before that heavy land shows up, and our other guy should be able to intercept it anyway. All right. So we're able to loot about 440,000 worth of stuff, which is great, because that's going to give us enough to uh, make our next financial report, or just about enough to make our next financial report. And we did lose an arm, but that's not such a big deal. Uh, we did, took a lot more damage, though, like physical damage. But uh, yeah, there's nothing in the right arm, so we weren't too worried about that. Now we got some parts here, which we're not going to take, so we have to decide what we want to keep here out of this stuff. So let's go down. Uh, DNI cockpit, no. Stealth armor. I think we're going to take the stealth armor. Gyro plus three melee. Endo steel, we don't need it. Regular heat sinks. There's an ECM as well, which would be nice. But I think the stealth armor is probably a little better. Although, who would we put that on? Let's take it, because we rarely come across these. So we're going to take that. All right, a couple of goblin pieces, which means we have a goblin now. Oh, okay. That's very interesting. Troublemaker, less damage taken. 
That's interesting. Maybe we get rid of the uh, panther and go with the goblin instead. Stealth armor, endo steel. Okay, so we didn't make out too badly. Okay, cool. There's our goblin. All right. Yeah, thirty-nine thousand. Not too bad at all for losing an arm. I mean, we we lost our, we lost the arm, so I figured it'd be you know a fair bit. But the fact that there was no real no real components in there. So right, so we're going to end the episode right here. Please, please feel free to jump over to the either the medium lance, which is the next battle, or the heavy lance right after that episodes. You'll find them here and here. And um, yeah, so if you like the episode, please feel free to subscribe. Continue on to the next two uh, missions for today, and uh, I'll see you. I'll see you over in the next mission.